Hi guys, thanks for joining me today. Today in this video I'm going to show you how I apply my false eyelashes and they'll stay on between three and five days. So I'm going to show you how I do that. It's very quick and it's very easy. So I'm going to get started. So the lash I'm going to be using today is by BH Cosmetic and it's the baby doll eyelash. This is the style right here. And I already have one on. Let me just show you very closely. Really pretty, it looks natural. Doesn't really look natural here, but when you apply it, it looks very natural. So the eyelash adhesive I'm going to use is by Revlon Precision. And this is it right here in the two. And I'll show you what that looks like. And each one of these packages comes with directions. Your eyelashes come with directions to use, and so does your false eyelash glue. Also, when you wear false eyelashes, you'll probably need to keep a, a nice supply of eye makeup remover. This one is called Essence of Beauty and this is the Gentle Eye Makeup Remover Non-Oily and I got this from CVS and as you can see it this is what I use I love it and you'll want to use some q-tips. Now I'm telling you about um, this because if you apply your eyelashes and you don't like the way it looks you don't have to worry just use a little bit of the eye makeup remover you put it on the q-tip you just run the q-tip across the lash band and it'll come right off quick and easy it won't stick so that's way to get it off very quickly if you need to also if you're applying your false eyelashes and you get glue on your lower lash you can do the same thing take a little eye makeup remover on a q-tip or a tissue and just run it across the area to remove any extra glue that may have just gotten on your lower your lower lash also you're going to need a pair of tweezers and I picked these up at the drugstore and you're going to need a magnifying mirror and that helps a lot and I have my magnifying mirror right here. So the first thing we're going to do is I'm going to take the glue, this is the glue right here, this is the one I keep right here at my dressing table and I'm going to, we're going to apply this glue, well first let me show you the brush, let me show you how this is what makes it easy. This is the glue right here. And let me get in really closely so that you can see the tip. The tip is really narrow. Now what I'm going to do with this brush is I'm going to run this brush across the base of my lash as if I was applying eyeliner. So that's how, this is step one. I'm going to take this applicator and just dot a little bit of glue along my lash line. The same way you would do if you were applying eyeliner. So go in very slowly, start in the middle and just make a couple of small dots just like that. And this glue is going to dry clear so you don't have to worry about it looking white when it's dry. And that's pretty much what it's going to look like. Try to make the lash, try to make the line as thin as possible. So you may want to practice a little bit. So if you need to practice this, practice this with maybe like an old black eyeliner that you may have laying around. Before I apply the glue to the lash band, this is what your lash is going to look like. Now if you need to trim your lashes, always trim from the outer edge first where the hairs are longer. That's where you want to make the make your lash shorter if you need to. Never cut from here. Always cut where the lashes are the longest. And that's usually right here at the outer end. You need to mold your eyelash to fit. You can just simply just take it, just roll it just like that. Just like this. Just to get it into a nice curve that'll make the eyelash just lay into your natural lash line that much easier. And I'm going to take the glue or the adhesive and I'm going to run it across the lash band just like this. That easy. Now as you can see the adhesive along my eyelash line, my lash line here, it's gotten very clear. You can't see it. It's still tacky. It's not dry. It's just clear. It's starting to get really tacky. And you want 
the glue along here to clear just a little bit just to get a little bit tacky so you're going to wait a few seconds longer before we apply it so now the best way to apply your eyelashes your false lashes is to just tilt your head a little bit make sure your eye is nice and relaxed just make sure it's nice and relaxed so that you can lay the false lash along your natural lash line you don't want any space in between this lash line and your own natural lash line so get it in as close as possible so I'm going to use my mirror I'm going to tilt my head forward and as you can see it's already sticking and just put the lash into place I'm going to go back in and I'm just going to put it, make sure it's in place just the way I like it. Because now it's going to stay on for a few days. And that's good. That's the way I like it. Now, if you're doing yours for the first time and you don't like the way it looks, again, use some eye makeup remover and a Q-tip. Just run it across the lash line. Just gently peel it off. Use your eye makeup remover to gently clean away any residue of glue that's there. Let it dry and then reapply. Try again. And I'm just going to just, just sort of like press them together to make sure that the natural lash and my lash is stuck together or kind of blending together. So that's it guys. That's how I apply my false eyelashes to make them stay on between three and five days. And it does vary. It may stay on four. Sometimes it stays on three. And there are many occasions where I have to take them off at the end of a week. So that's it. If you have any questions about this method, um, please leave them. Um, questions below or you can private message me if you like and um, again if you need to practice because you don't want to waste your glue just practice lining your eye with um, some old black eyeliner so that you can see how straight you're making your line so that's it guys thanks so much for joining me I do appreciate it you take care and you be well and I'll see you at the next video bye bye